Well, hello everybody. My favourite Christmas carol that I've chosen is While Shepherds Watch Their Flocks by Night. Let me just read to you the first couple of verses. While shepherds watch their flocks by night, all seated on the ground, the angel of the Lord came down and glory shone around. Fear not, said he, for mighty dread had seized their troubled minds. Glad tidings of great joy I bring to you and all mankind. I announce to you good news and great joy that shall be to all people. And this hymn reminds me right from the very outset that for the first time in centuries, God's glory had returned to earth in the form of his only begotten son and the one that we now call our Lord and Saviour, Jesus Christ. And who was this good news of the gospel first revealed to? To kings, great politicians, the rich and famous? No, to the lowest of the low of Jewish society, to shepherds whose work made them unacceptable in the temple and ceremonious unclean to partake in anything that went on there. And so it was fitting that the good news of God's good shepherd came to these lonely shepherds on that hillside above Bethlehem that night. Let me read to you from Luke chapter two, verse eight. Now there were in that same country shepherds living out in the field, keeping watch over their flock by night. And behold, an angel of the Lord stood before them and the glory of the Lord shone around them and they were greatly afraid. Then the angel said to them, lovely words, do not be afraid. For behold, I bring you good tidings of great joy that will be for all people. For it is born to you this day in the city of David, a saviour who is Christ the Lord. And so it was when the angels had gone away from them into heaven that the shepherds said to one another, let us now go to Bethlehem and see this thing that has come to pass, which the Lord has made known to us. And they came with haste and they found Mary and Joseph and the babe lying in a manger. Now when they'd seen him, they made widely, widely known the sayings which were told them concerning the child. And all those who heard it marveled at those things which had told them by the shepherds. Then the shepherds returned glorifying and praising God for all the things they had heard and seen and that was told them. Notice how clear directions were given to the shepherds in order that they could find Jesus. And they responded to the good news that had been given to them immediately. And they started what in effect was the first Christmas rush as they hastened into Bethlehem. You see, these shepherds, they came, they saw, and they believed. And that my friends, is the gospel in a nutshell. That is the real message of Christmas. But guess what? They couldn't keep this good news for themselves. They just had to go out and tell other people. So as we go into this Christmas season, maybe that's something we can learn from the shepherds. Let's tell other people about the greatest Christmas gift of all, the Lord Jesus Christ. Well, thank you so much for listening to me and have a lovely blessed Christmas. God bless you.